you're not talented enough. Like no team is talented enough to just go to go play like shinny and not give a rip about your own end and 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 always think offense first, defense last and and beat a team. Like how many times do they have to get proven to them that they're not good enough to beat even the bottom feeders of the team when they show up with that mindset? They they lose to the worst teams in the world for several years. And it's because they just show up and just expect it to be a win. Oh, uh, good. We got a night off tonight. Oh, we don't have to prepare. Oh, we don't have to really have a game plan. We're just going to go out there and our skill will win us the game. It blows up in their face time and time again. And it's just like you can't even you can't even predict games because you don't know where this team's going to be. And I've said it before. That comes down to leadership and coaching. You have to have that room in a mindset that's ready to go. You can't let them take their foot off the pedal just because you're playing uh, a team that's in the bottom third of, of the NHL. It does not work that way. This, this, the disparity in the league is not that big. Uh, The the last place team can beat you. doesn't matter who you are. And the Leafs just keep having to learn that lesson over and over again to the point where they're not even learning the lesson. They're just repeating it over and over again, which is why we get so pissed off sometimes and why we doubt this team and why we say that these guys aren't going to go through the playoffs. I want nothing more than to be on the bandwagon for the Maple Leafs. I want nothing more than to talk about them like they are God's gift to the world. I want nothing no more, more than to be so proud of, of the way they play. I want to rub it in everyone's face that doesn't like the Leafs. I want that. I want to be Mr. Positive. But they constantly do the dumbest shit that shoots them in the foot, ruins their season, causes fans to to lose hope and not have faith in them anymore. What else are you supposed to do when they get, you know, they get shelled by these teams that they're supposed to be better than? But but being a good hockey team doesn't just mean you have four guys or five guys that have a whole bunch of points. That's not a good hockey team. That's a good hockey player. And this team has good hockey players, but they have not shown they're a good hockey team. Because when the going gets tough, they falter. When they're supposed to do things that, that's in their DNA, they screw it up and they're unprepared and they have these unspeakable losses and, and these brutal performances. And I'm, it's, it's tiresome and it makes you become negative and it makes you lose hope in the team and lose you know, an ability to, to believe in them. And that's where we are right now. And that's why they're tickering around a wild card spot and they're they were like stanley cup favorites one of them coming into the season it's it's a piss off man and and losing to the ottawa senators in that fashion when you sh- like you have your you have half the barn cheering for you it's almost like a home game and you know you're putting jones back in net you should have every reason to be like we got to get our ducks in a row what is the system in, in our defensive zone you know turnovers in the neutral zone are going to be unacceptable if it's a low percentage play we got to get it deep we got to protect that puck we got to have numbers we got to support it no fuck it all we're just going to go out and just whoop de doo and oh baby I'll, I'll just find someone back door and we'll roof it and have a big sick selly and then selly by the bench so sick and it just blows up in your face because they're not good enough to do that nobody is and when they're going to learn that i have no idea make sure to check out more of our content right here on the leafs nation youtube page we got long form interviews we got clips we got epic rants by jay rozo we simply have it all and don't forget you can find out much more at the leafsnation.com thanks so much for watching